Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Pump Bank Farms. Um, figured I'd better break the video camera out because uh, it's a beautiful winter day. It's probably plus 10 and I'm going to wash some equipment off. Starting with the wagon here. So I'm working on it right now, this is the wagon. Before I started making videos, we sank this wagon, I wish I got on video, we sank it right down to the axle. On the one side, we were very close to tipping, so needless to say, there's a lot of mud to wash off. Let's get to her. done it okay so long that doesn't look good so basically this um that is the motor for the for the door for the winch it's never was heavy enough to start with only can lift it like halfway. You gotta use the loader for the rest of the way. I was using the loader and I must have been pulling back a bit. I didn't realize. We have now. So these pieces here popped off. And that's what was holding that in apparently. So I gotta fix that. Uh, first I gotta close the door and get that piece of two by eight or two by 10. To stop, or is it two by 12? To stop, uh, so it's not twisting like that because that can't be healthy. Ooh, yikes. Let's see how far I can back up yet. Well, there's a bit of room yet. But I think that's about enough. I might back up a bit more. This door closed. So, this is the next thing we're washing off. small breakdown I got to fix a belt came off of a conveyor I believe I got another belt somewhere just gotta grab some tools here so I believe we need a three-quarter I'm not sure if we need a 916 or a half but we'll take both and 916 and a half all right let's go see what we can figure out belts nowhere to be found but luckily I believe we have another spear Is this it? What are the numbers? BL52. If I remember right, that should be the right one. Let's go fix. Let's go see if it is. So this it's the conveyor that goes up and it loads in this wagon. Right up. See that motor there? It's the belt up there. Ah, climb up. Uh, 
Okay, so basically how this works, I gotta get in there and uh, there's some bolts I gotta loosen off. And then this is the tightening rod. Tighten, loosen it. And I got an old belt I tried putting on before, but it might be a little too stretched out. So first I'm gonna try tightening it, see if I can tighten it enough. If there's not enough tightening in there, I gotta put the new belt on. So. so, the old belt, I got enough in there, I think, to tighten it enough. So the new belt will stay new for a little longer. Now I just gotta tighten this stuff up. Okay. Let's see if uh let's see if uh, the conveyor starts now. She's started. Very good. One project down. 173,000 more to go. You know, I was, the reason I made up this bag is I was so sick of constantly taking tools out of the shop and, and then you don't have them in the shop and it just seemed like an endless roller coaster. So I made up this bag. I'm like, this will be handy and it's more handy than I could have ever thought of. Um, not every tool I'm ever going to need in here, but most of them. Most of them are in here. So, yeah, best uh, little thing I've done as far as making something to be handy. Uh. Now, I'm going to work on cleaning off the disc. So, basically... First, before I go what pressure washer, I'm just gonna clean off all this mud by hand. Um, anything that's stuck in between the rollers, I am also gonna get out, but actually that looks pretty clean, so. Biggest, maybe clean off some of this stuff here by hand, because some of that stuff, you start pressure washing, it makes a huge mess. So, I'd rather just get that out by hand first. Got the mud washed, uh, pushed off by hand. Now I'm driving over to Jay over there. And then we wash. So we're gonna unfold it so that I can get on top of it to wash. product but I gotta lift it up now and uh, usually I don't know if anyone's ever washed off of this but I'm guessing to lift it up and there'll be a whole new underside to wash and I realize just how not close to done I am and that is where it's gonna call home for the next few months anyway guys I think that will be it for this video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.